welcome back to my channel. Today, we went out shopping. Today is November 1st when I'm filming this. And so Merry Christmas, right? It's officially past Halloween. I feel like we can do everything Christmas now, right? So I noticed that all the stores officially are putting up Christmas stuff and wiping away the Halloween stuff. And while we had a great Halloween, I'm really excited to start putting up my Christmas stuff. But I happened to be out shopping at a few stores today. And I just wanted to show you a little Christmas haul of some of the items I got. We went to the Dollar Tree and we went to Bath and Body Works and to Target. So the Target dollar spot was kind of half Halloween, half starting to get Christmas. So I'm going to keep stalking the dollar spot and see what Christmas stuff they put out. But I got a few cute things. So I wanted to show y'all what I got today. So I'll put a few clips in here about some of the things that the Dollar Tree was starting to put out. I only got three things. I didn't get a whole lot from there today, but one of the cute things that I thought that they had were little bitty Christmas trees, like so little tiny ones for maybe your desk or something like that. And they were pretty cute. They had one set up and just for a dollar, I thought that was a great deal. So if you see those little Christmas trees, if you need just a little tiny one for your desk, go check out the Dollar Tree but they had some great wrapping paper. I'll do a clip now and show you some of the wrapping paper that I saw. I went there for a specific type of wrapping paper that I saw one of my friends had gotten and I couldn't find that design, but I'm gonna keep checking for it. It was really cute. But these are the ones that I picked out. I got this Mickey and Minnie one and it's got the Christmas design. It's so cute. And of course, these are just a dollar. And my husband pointed out that of course they're just a dollar because they don't have that much on them. This comes with 20 square feet. Um, so, and I pointed out, I said, I know this doesn't have a whole lot of wrapping paper on it, but if you go and say, for instance, we went right to Target afterwards and they had a roll. I didn't compare exactly. So I don't know if it was the exact 20 square feet, but it was a roll that was had barely any on it and it was $5. And I said, see, you know, so this dollar, wrapping paper is it's a good deal and it's so cute i figured that would be cute for my girls or for niece and nephew gifts i figured that would be cute wrapping paper and then i got this one just a little bit more classic christmas it's got goofy and and donald and mickey and christmas trees and pluto's on there so and Minnie, of course so that was just really cute disney you know i gotta get the disney stuff so this one also has 20 square feet. The last thing that I got from the Dollar Tree, which I thought was so cute, I have a couple of decorations for Christmas with these these old like vintage trucks on them with the Christmas trees in the back. So I thought this would be really cute. I'm sure I can find a place to hang this up, but for a dollar. And I'll again, I'll show a clip of some of the other signs that they had. And the lady at the register said that these were gonna go really fast. She said she had somebody come in and buy a bunch of them. So I just thought that was really cute. And they didn't even have at the Dollar Tree, they were still working on unboxing a ton of stuff because of course it's still early. So there's a bunch of stuff at the Dollar Tree. There's a bunch of cute craft stuff, bunch of wrapping paper, a bunch of gift bags. They had some tins there for goodies. We're planning on baking some little goodies around Christmas time, like chocolate chip cookies and fudge and stuff like that. And I wanna get some of those little tins to pass out to our neighbors and teachers, just a bunch of different things. And so I think I'm gonna go back to the Dollar Tree and stock up on those little tins when I, where I can get them for just a dollar. So the next place we went was Target's Dollar Spot. And I did not film the clips of the Dollar Spot. It was really packed, so I didn't wanna be whipping out my camera and getting everybody and get getting in the way of everybody shopping. But like I said, my Target just had about half, half of the stuff, maybe just a couple aisles or a couple rows of it packed with Christmas stuff. So I'm gonna keep checking. But I got this tote bag. It's a Buffalo Check tote bag. I honestly, I I know I'll use this, but it's just, it was just so cute. And I love this pattern for winter. And this was $7, I believe. Let's see. Yep, it was $7. But I just thought how cute, if you do things like um, monogramming, or if you have a Cricut machine that you can print stickers, you could put somebody's name on this for a gift, and it's got a little gift tag on here. So I just thought that would be really, really cute. But I just thought with a cute winter outfit with some boots and black leggings, and just, I just thought this would be really cute to carry around in the winter. And it's a good size. So 
that would hold quite a bit. The other, I got three more things from Target. I got this mug set, which again, it looks like you can, you know, set it up to do as a gift. It says to and from, and it says be merry and be bright. And I, they had a lot of other choices. These were really cute. Um, I do a lot of decorate. I do a lot of red and white thing decorating in my kitchen. So I figured these would be really cute to go with the mugs that I already had. I have some polka dot mugs that are red with white polka dots on them from Pottery Barn that I got years and years ago. So I thought these would fit right in with those. And these were $5. So for two mugs for $5, that's a really good deal. And these are super cute. And then last but not least from Target, I got two packs of these, but I got different designs. It's Lady Socks. It's three pairs. These were $3. And they had lots of designs for these. They had red and white. They had more kind of burgundy and white. Um, they had these gray color. And then I got another kind. They had kind of like light blue, kind of like the snowflake color. They had those colors. And then I got these, the pink and gray and white. I think these are so cute. And I'm sure I've mentioned in the past in other videos, but if you're new to my channel, I, I work from home. And so when every day when I come into my office, I always have on a pair of socks. I've got my electric heater going and I always like to put on some comfy cozy socks. And these are pretty thin, but I like thin socks sometimes. So I figured these would be really cool for winter. So that's the other design. You can see on the back, the actual designs of when they're pulled out. And it says shoe size five to 10. I almost got some of these for my daughter, for my older daughter, she's 10. And actually I may get her some because I bet they'll fit her. We can almost share a, a shoe size, but not quite. So I bet she would fit into these socks and I think she would really like these. I think they're so cute. And I like how all of these have the little giftable giftable tags on there. It says to and from. So these, I don't know if y'all are like me, but I mean, you cannot go wrong. I could have 500 pairs of cozy socks. And if somebody got me some socks or like the coffee mugs or blankets, I could have a million of those. And I would be more than happy to get those as gifts because those are just always the best gifts to get. So these would be really good to get for gifts or stocking stuffers. That would be good too. Okay, so the last place we went was Bath and Body Works, and they had their candles as of today. It's November 1st, but I don't know when this sale is going to end. As of today, they have their candles for $12.95 on sale, which that sale comes and goes quite a bit, especially around this time of the year. So if you happen to miss this one, I'm sure it'll come back. But I got some candles while they're on sale. I went there for one of my favorite fall smells, the scents of candles, the, oh, what's it called? that pumpkin pecan waffle because last year they carried that scent all throughout the holidays. And so I, I'm out of that scent now. I have just a little bit left of my last candle. So I thought I'll stock up on that and they didn't have it. Now I haven't checked the website, so they may have it on the website. I need to check, but um, they didn't have that one. So I stocked up on some of my other favorites. This one I got, this is a new one to me. It's the maple cinnamon pancakes. This says it has notes of maple syrup and fluffy buttermilk pancakes. And it does, it does smell like maple syrup and pancakes. Now that I'm home and smelling this one, this one I was on the fence about, I don't know why. Um, but there's just a tiny hint of cinnamon, but it just smells like pancakes. It's similar to my, my pumpkin pecan waffle candle. So I should have gotten more of these because I think this is probably going to end up being my favorite one. Oh, it smells so good. I love that. And then um, this is one that I get every year because it, it does smell just like a Christmas tree. It's the fresh balsam. And I don't know how else to describe it. I mean, it smells like a fresh Christmas tree, but it says fragrance notes of woodland balsam, crisp eucalyptus, fir branches, and cedarwood. Christmas tree. Mm, this is Christmas to me right here. We burn this every year and we have for so many years. So every time I smell this, it is just Christmas in a candle. And I got two of these because these are perfect to burn in my office as I'm working throughout the day. It's not a super, super strong smell. It's just enough for in my office. I love it. It's the Merry Cookie and it smells just like a vanilla cookie. So it's, I love it. And I love these designs on these candles. 
A lot of times if you don't like the design, sometimes they'll have different designs that you can peek through. But this says fragrance notes of fresh baked cookies, sparkling sugar crystals, and rich vanilla. So mm, perfect little sugar cookie Christmas candle. And I got two of those. And this one my husband spotted, and I love this one. It's called Yuletide. It smells really similar to the Christmas tree one. Let's see what this scents. Okay. It says fragrance notes of rosemary and pine essential oils with notes of eucalyptus and cedar. So that's why it smells a lot like that fresh balsam candle, but it's just a touch of something different. I don't know that made it, it, I love that. My husband said that just smells like Christmas to me. So, so we definitely got that one. I like the design on that one too. And I like how it's blue. The other things that I got are red and green, which really go with my decoration, but I like that this one's blue. And I had a coupon for a free item with a purchase of $10 and it could be up to, I think, a $14 value. So I got the Vanilla Bean Noel, the 24 hour moisture ultra shea body cream. So this is my favorite one of their Christmas scents. I used to work at Bath and Body Works like 11 or 12 or 13 years ago. It was a long time ago, but, but they had this scent. You know, this is like a, this scent's been with them forever. And I used to get this every year. And so this is one of my favorites. So I figured I would grab that while they have it and it was free. So as you can imagine, this one, if you've not smelled Vanilla Bean Noel, it says fragrance notes of fresh vanilla bean, sugar cookies, warm caramel, whipped cream, and snow-kissed musk. In the past, I haven't tried this specific body cream yet this year, but in the, in the past, this scent really stays on my skin really well. And I love if I shower at night and then put, just slather this all over and you just, you smell like sugar cookies all night long while you're sleeping. <laughs> And then all throughout the day, I just, I love this, so this smell. All right, so that's what I bought today. I just wanted to show you guys a little haul of some fun Christmas goodies I got. Almost all of these, I mean, excluding the wrapping paper, could be such wonderful gift ideas for all those little gifts that you have to get for people along the way. But this, the dollar, the dollar spot at, the dollar spot at Target is such a good place to stock up on those little gifts that you have to get. So check it out because I'm sure your Target's starting to put that Christmas stuff out. Like I said, I'm going to start stocking them as if I don't go there a couple times every week anyways, but I'm going to start checking it out and seeing what Christmas stuff they have. So I hope you guys had a happy Halloween and I hope you guys are having fun gearing up for Thanksgiving and Christmas. Let me know some of the things that y'all are finding and what are your favorite Christmas candles from Bath and Body Works. I always like to hear everybody's favorites for the holidays. So let me know down below what your favorites are. And I hope y'all enjoyed seeing the stuff that I bought today and I hope you have a great rest of the day. Please subscribe if you haven't already so you can hang around and check out my videos each week. I hope you guys have a great rest of the day and I will see you in the next video. Bye!